to like what you were doing in the you know the little turnaround bit. Um, you mentioned about sort of you know the interesting chords and stuff. Yeah, basically what we've done is just arranged it. So every guitar should know a dominant seven chord. So we have B seven, and then the next chord that comes, which is quite a dissonant chord, is a C seven flat five, which on its own. <laughs> movement from the chord. Then we go down to a B flat, big mouthful, B flat 7 flat 5. Same voicing as the C7 flat 5. And then A7. And then another altered dominant chord which goes up to B7 sharp 5. So the the, um, the root beat is uh, just a dance beat. So you've got. Um, need that. That needs to be there all the time. But what really makes the beat is the. Um, I sort of call it a little hook. You know, you got the. If that wasn't there, it would be pretty boring. So um, you got the beat. So you, uh, if I add in those little bits. Make the beat, so to speak. But it's, you've got to be really loose as well. I mean, uh, no back. There's quite a lot of space in that. Why do you think there's a lot of space in it rhythmically? It just keeps the time better, and you've got a lot more space to build with bass and vocals, perhaps. Absolutely, yeah. And 